Welcome back to Indian Times Daily. The top 10 headlines from America are President Donald Trump has put pro football players on a notice for week 4 of the NFL season. However, New Orleans Saints players, coaches and staff knelt before the start of the anthem at Sunday's first game in London but stood in unison once it began. People living near the Guajataka River in Puerto Rico were evacuated over possible dam burst. The dam has had a higher load than usual over Hurricane Maria directly hit the US territory two weeks ago and contributed to pressure on the dam. President Donald Trump believes that his Secretary of State was wasting his time trying to negotiate with North Korea. The US had established direct channels with the secretive Asian nation and was seeking to calm tension related to its defiant pursuit of a nuclear program. American lawmakers have been investigating whether Russian oil money is funding anti-oil protest movement in North America. A US House of Representatives committee has sent letters to online giants asking for data for any Russian purchases of anti-oil and anti-fracking ads. Actor Lin-Manuel Miranda has criticized President Donald Trump for his comments about poor leadership of Puerto Rican authorities. Miranda in a tweet said that with no longer lines, Trump was going straight to hell, adding that he was golfing while the authorities worked 24 bar 7. Three people were killed and two others were wounded in a shooting in downtown Lawrence in Kansas. Police officers who were near the area when multiple gunshots were heard are seeking assistance in identifying the suspect involved as an investigation is underway. Iran has urged Europe to defy the US on imposing new sanctions as it is the only way to stop its nuclear deal from collapsing. Iran would develop much more advanced nuclear technology if Europe followed the US in returning to a sanctioned regime. Uber's ousted CEO Travis Kalanick has appointed two members to the firm's board of directors for seats under his control. Kalanick said that he was appointing these seats now in light of a recent board proposal to restructure the board and alter the company's voting rights. Twitter users in some states of America have shared more polarizing political news and conspiratorial content during the 2016 presidential election. The findings led by researchers from Oxford University showed that the content presented faulty reasoning or misleading information to manipulate the readers. A solar event has sparked a global aurora at the Martian surface and caused the radiation level to double than the highest ever recorded NASA scientists have found. The orbiter has also recorded radiation levels on the surface more than double any previously measured by the Curiosity rover's RAD. I'll be back. Stay logged on to IndianTimesDaily.com as the news from Gujarat and Punjab follows.